Hey everyone! In this video, we'll see what's new in July 2024 product update. Let's dive in. So, data panel improvement. If you search for uh, any component or file, it just shows up all the results. And when you right click, now you have showing location option. So, if you click on this, you have the file directory so now it got easier to locate the file for configurations we got new preferred name so for this configuration we have only the design name so if you go to your preferences general design configurations you have option to enable design name configure design name part number and if you apply you got config design name and the part number if you choose export you have config design and active design active design will export that particular configuration whereas config design will export all the configurations and if you click on export you can save it locally coming to design we got new option called spun profile so by using which you can create the sketch for the turning. So under create project include spun profile. Select it and geometry pick the body and axis based on which it rotates. You can select any cylindrical profile or any axis and if you say OK. Now you have that profile. Just close it and you can use revolve to create solid body. And this geometry can be useful for turning. And we got improvement in the fastness. So the search filtering got improved and and when you select a fastener, now you have option to flip it. No more extra clicks. And this only applicable for sketching. When it detects a 3D model, automatically chooses the side. Though you have the freedom to uh, rotate it later. Coming to the drawings. Now in the automated drawings, you have ordinate dimensions. And when you click you can choose the location also and even you can pick the uh, origin manually let's say here now zero is here and all the dimensions calculated from that point easy peasy and not only that in the dimensions you have curve min and max with the help of this, you can show the minimum distance and maximum distance for the curves. Be it a circle, be it a curve. You have this. And we got one more features in the document settings. In the annotation, now you can change the dimension gap distance now if you see this is our point and we have dimension from this point so that distance is 2.1 now let's change it to 5 mm now you can see the distance from this point to the dimension changed so that can be adjusted in the document settings annotation let's revert back to 2.1 Say okay isn't that cool adding more to that for the perspective view we got visible and hidden edges in the direct base component coming to sheet metal now when you export the DXF from sheet metal 
you will get the bin lines let's unfold this here in the insert you have to select one sketch per layer and pick the file now you can see all the layers you say ok and in the sketches you got all the layers this is bend extent bends interior profiles outer profiles so previously we used to get all these in a single sketch coming to electronics so now you have the option to change the net or signal colors so here in the appearance you select any in the signal you can pick any color and if you say okay that particular signal got change of color now it is easy to identify the signals so command line interface improved a lot so from here you can directly ask for help just say help and uh, let it know whatever the help you want let's say net i want to know about net and if you say enter it will take you to that website and it shows you more information about the net isn't that cool coming to manufacturing now you can mark the templates as your favorites so if you go to your fusion library you can mark these your favorites and you can invoke those from here and there's one more improvement in the heights tab if you edit your toolpath in the heights now you can choose the height based on your fixture so that is the uh, picture top and this is uh, uh, the fixture will be applicable for retracting top and bottom height so these are the some useful updates that we got and there are more you can check all those in the blog post visit that through the link in description as always thank you so much for watching comment down what is your favorite uh, update and Stay tuned.